you're gonna be down, but it's about how you come at the end until the clock hits zero and nothing's over. That first half, it was a lot harder to call plays and kind of set up things because um, the wind was so bad and the rain was so bad. And if anything, we're more amped up. Like, we got it. Like, we're, we're this weather team, you know? We're used to this bad weather. We're gonna come out there and we're gonna, we're gonna take it. We're the better team when you look at it from the sideline. Yeah, yeah. There's no reason why we don't put together a good second half. A half's over with. Let's focus. Great football team. Screw up. They don't play great halves all the time. Gave a lot of things out there to them, offensively, defensively, but we're moving the ball up and down the field. They're not like us. We're built different than them, you hear me? My family traveled far, and shoot, it's a big win, and I'm glad they got to see me in my last year. Please. Man, my family's everything. Uh, my dad loves game football. My mom loves it. They've always been there for me, my parents. And, you know, I'm just very thankful that they're supporting me, doing whatever they could just to come see me play, no matter what state it's in. Get an opportunity from high school to play for him um, as a quarterback, which was to me harder than um, coaching with him. Um, playing for him as a quarterback is tough. Um, but it was a lot of fun, um, a lot of great memories, a lot of wins, a lot of losses, loss on Hail Mary, things like that that you remember, right? But um, as a coach, man, it's been it's been incredible. He's a player's coach, but what people also don't know is that he's also a coach's coach. He hires you to do a job, and he's gonna let you do your job. Now, you know, he's gonna look at things, he's gonna watch some film, and he's always gonna have some, you know, some questions and ask things, but when it comes down to it, um, he lets you be you. And I think that's what makes um, this place special with him leading the program and, and working for him. It's awesome, you know, my wife is incredible. She, you know, she's the reason I'm able to do this great job and, and, um, and affect these kids um, on and off the field. No matter what happens at practice, no matter how mad I get or how frustrated, 
you know, it's awesome to see them too after practice. And Palmer loves to come for Wednesday nights because um, that's pizza night. She's a big pizza fan, so she always comes and we get pizza as a staff, and that's that's her favorite night to come to Pratt's because she always gets a, a piece of pizza, so so she loves that night. So. Yeah. Here you go. Yeah. Hi, Bucko. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Burger. Is that your best friend? My dad is my biggest critic, so if, if he see me down or if I'm not doing something, that's the first person that's calling me like. Hey, you need to get it together. Or you doing good, but it ain't good enough. But it's always never good until something's over with. So until so I got done with college, uh, my first undergrad, he like, yeah, you got an A, but you can do better. And then when you get a, that's why I was hard. And same with my mom. My mom is more of the, she'll pray for me. Uh, one one thing I'm gonna share, like with Marlon, I don't people don't notice we sit behind the defensive bench because ever since he was a little pee wee. I would be, we don't even have to talk. I just, you know, look and sit behind them in, in the stands and we just look and we just read each other from there. You know, so I know when he's having a good game, when he's having a, a bad game. Then I guess with me, as far as me, I'm a social bug. So I'm like everywhere, I'm all over. And as my husband said, we'll sit in the actual, um, the crowd with the student section. Cause like even the last game, we're trying to get the wave started just to get it turned up. You know, I'm the turn up mom, you know? And so just to be able to see him, um, to encourage his uh, team members and to be able to get hyped. I love it when he, there are, you know, get the aggressiveness and, you know, when you make the big plays, and we look at like, yeah, okay, we see you, you know, but just to see him having fun, enjoying what he does, you know, playing on the field and just living his best life. So that's what we enjoy. We talk about family, like brotherhood yes. and everything, you know, our son plays, but we don't come and cheer just for him. You know, it's like the whole team. And I know y'all know that we, you know, cook for the D-line because, you know, a lot of times they, they don't get, you know, the recognition mm -hmm. that they want. So we just kind of come show like we love y'all. You know, even though people are not talking about y'all, we know the show. So it's like they call us mom and pops. So we just like love on everybody. If it's something that we have or something that we can do, we make sure that that player has something or a parent may contact us, hey, can you get this for our child or whatever. We want to make sure that we're able to assist with that. My whole family has just been hard on me all since I was a young kid, but I know them being hard isn't just them being hard, it's more for me to be successful. I feel like that has helped me on my path throughout college and then it's going to help me on my path for my future. a lot. My mom like makes like almost every game. She brings my little, my little sister and older sister. I love them. Make sure my camera is ready to go.
It's hard to get a win. It's real hard to beat a team like you beat them. Oh, yeah. 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 Awesome. Yeah. 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 Live on the air. What's up? This woman right here is famous. Uh, <laughs> and it's my mama. It's my baby right here. Yeah.